Okay, look, there's some beef rolling out there between the Fresh Feet podcast and the whatever podcast and with Pearl. Um, I don't think so because, well, she's not so involved. They answered more the whatever podcast, so Pearl was not so involved. Uh, I don't know. Yeah, she doesn't know. <laughs> now, the thing is, is that some guy uh, called to the Fresh and Fit podcast and asked about why they not collab with some specific YouTubers and they asked to got to the guy which ones pointed finger at us and he said well I wanted to know about the just pearly things and the whatever podcast and let me show you what Myron answer Go ahead. Who, in who, detail. who are you talking about specifically? And I'll go ahead and tell you why we don't work. Just purely, just purely things and whatever podcast. I knew he was going to say that. Yeah. Okay. Number one, y'all might not know this, and I have no problem with Pearl personally, but she made a hit piece on us back when we were going through the fucking situation with Anus and Reach. Yes. Okay. I have a serious, uh, you know, as you guys know, loyalty is extremely important to me. If you talk shit about me, I will not forget. And she made a hit piece on us. Y'all might not know about this, and I'm not saying this to attack or whatever, but facts are facts. She made a hit piece mm. on us back when all this shit was going on in August of 2021. At the worst time, she kicked us when we were down. Yeah. So that's why we don't work with her. There's her answer. And now as far as whatever goes, Stop the crying. reason we don't work with them is because I'm not going to align myself with someone that isn't a part of the red pill space for real. I'm going to just call it a million. It's money. He's, he's here for money, bro. Yeah. Let's just call it all the way a thousand. He's here to make a buck, which is fine. I'm never going to knock someone for being a capitalist, but he's not really in this space to help men from what I can see. If you're out here mm. selling pocket pussies and, you know, having, you know, long ass podcasts, you know, draw clips, etc. I understand the business strategy, but we don't align with that because you guys have asked us a million times. So I want to address this once and for all. Pearl, y'all know why. Whatever, we don't align in our belief system. That's not to knock him. Or who he is, or how we he runs his business. Best, by the way. We actually wish him the best. There you go. But he doesn't. He, he doesn't have the same values as us. And I personally think he's in it for the money, and that's not why we're in it. We're in it for completely different reasons. Okay. There you Here's your answer. What do you got to say about? Okay. So yeah, I don't know. Like I think they should uh, let the guy answer because. It's just a method that is bordering them, but the thing is, the guy of the whatever podcast answer uh, in a comment, and yeah, there's a lot of things. Let, let me let me show you again. Um, he answered um, on this channel called Back to the Roots. Uh, that is a channel that does some clips of podcasts and Red Pill Space. And for our surprise, the guy of whatever podcast answer there, let me show you right now what he said. Um, As for my own uns unsustainable claim that we're just in it for the money, so F and F does their show for charity and out of the goodness of their heart, huh? F and F monetize their audience way more than we do. Some of what they do, DMs on demand, High Valley Academy doing way more sponsorships, pen pills, Jesus, selling tickets to sub milestone. I will buy, I will buy this pen pill, selling tickets to sub milestone parties, live events. $100 if anyone has exact dollar amounts, DM me on IG. Merch, $50 for a t-shirt, low, fresh, lol. Fresh charge, uh, 3K for an hour, consult, blah, 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 modern charge, blah, blah, blah. They're charged for a lot of things. And the thing is, uh, we put on entertaining show, if you want to drop super chat that we read, cool. That's pretty much to the extent of it. We are not flitching our audience selling our own digital products. 
Well, I don't see problem in selling products. Like, uh, I don't see any problem in that. They, they can do whatever they want. Like, we are doing landing page funnels and charging, blah, blah, blah. Values don't align. So funny, after just a few podcasts ago, Martin said that he never starts talking ish first. I've had nothing but possible things to say about and positive things to say. Go watch my episode with Tristan and I've shut out them out a bunch. Uh, I think the guy is winning this discussion because, well, you know, both monetizes and I don't see any problem with that. Um, the problem is on the internet, we know how things are going. Probably they will ignore that and not answer them. But I think that the best solution for that will be a podcast between them. Because think about it. That's the purpose of the podcasts. Because, you know, on the internet, on the internet we live in our own bubbles. We have our own niches. And we have niches and niches like the Red Pill space has different niches and the red pill and you know like when i when i start to watch podcasts i i thought i found very very interesting because you know like for example joe rogan uh brings different inviter inviter invite different um type of people and you have a chance to know different niches which is the opposite of the internet behavior that is you know to be just in one niche and to follow this tendency, I think they should participate in some podcasts, both. And not arguing and discussing like a bunch of girls, you know, because they're not a high value man. So I think they should have a discussion face to face to everyone know their opinion, their thoughts. But I think this reason of the fresh and fit is not so reliable like uh, just because they monetize come on guys that's not a big deal and the guy from whatever yeah i can agree but i don't like i don't like i don't like too much how he entertained the show i prefer my own oratory his way to discuss and argue things it's more clear to me. I don't know. I, I, I like more because uh, it causes more um, controversy and more um, arguing um, in the podcast on a podcast. But other than that, I think they should, you know, have a discussion in some podcast um, or in whatever or in Fresh Fit or both go to another podcast. I think that's how things work on the internet. And that's how things work better. Oh, uh, uh, actually, a be uh, even better thing uh, could be they have a you know a UFC fight between them. That would be the prop. That that probably would be <laughs> the best thing to do.